people want to give you know steps of being a, a speaker and you know they usually say story point how to and when you ask me this question about being a presenter i said i'm going to give you something that is totally fresh being a strong presenter is a piece of cake so c stands for confidence tell us about that look basically on your c stands for confidence what we're saying there is you just have to show up and stand in your power and ask yourself several several questions why are you giving this presentation what am I, what do i want people to take from this speech and those type of questions what about the a for authenticity the a for authenticity you have to be yourself you can't be anybody else and you and i know many people who always try to be like a Zig Ziglar. They try to be like a Les Brown or whatever the case may be. But those individuals, yes, while they are powerful, they will always be themselves. So what we have to do is we have to truly be ourselves and also use words that are uniquely you. Would you like to know what number three is? That's right. So you've, you've said confidence. That's the C. A, authenticity. So yes, please tell us the K. Knowledge, to be a strong presenter, you must have confidence, you must have authenticity, and you must have the knowledge. You know, it's called that intellectual power that we have here, you, you have to have it. So to be able to have that knowledge before you speak, you always have to do your research. Mm -hmm. You really, really have to do your research. Because when you do your research, you'll understand what's going on and you will be able to connect with your audience. And then the last one is simply this, enthusiasm. When it comes to enthusiasm, you and I both know that you have to come from a place of joy.